In this video, I'm going to share with you where to find an evaluation copy of Windows to test out software. Let's get started. Now let's search for Windows Developer uh, VM. There we go. And notice that the download link, uh, the first link that comes out says download the Windows 10 virtual machine and this is actually a Microsoft uh, website. Let's head over and take a look. Now on this page, you are going to find a uh, Windows development environment for the various uh, hypervisor platforms. You have one for VMware, Hyper-V, VirtualBox, and Parallels. It is a um, uh, Microsoft website, so um, you are assured that it is not uh, from any dubious sources. And we will download the VMware version because uh, we will be importing this into a VMware uh, workstation player. So we will click on the download uh, link here and wait for the download to complete. I'm going to pause the video now and come back when the download completes. Now it has taken a while but the download is finally complete. Um, now let's go on and take a look at the rest of this website. Uh, you will found, find the file hashes uh, here for all the uh, images that is available. And we will now uh, compute the hash of the our download against uh, and check against the published uh, file hash on the website. This is for integrity checking purposes. Our download is actually the VMware version, the VMware zip file. So the hash that uh, we are expecting should be this value. To compute um, the hash of our download, let us first fire up our PowerShell. Now to calculate the hash, we first head over to um, the location where we have uh, downloaded our file. In my case, it is actually in the temp directory. This is where I have downloaded the, um, the uh, VMware image for the Windows uh, machine. And so um, to calculate the hash, uh, key in this command called get file hash, sorry, get file hash, followed by the file name. Yep. And give it some time to run, it's a huge file, uh, but uh, the um, hash that is calculated should match the hash that is given on the website, which is this one ending with uh, 5a, 5e. I'm going to pause the video now and wait for the uh, hash to complete uh, calculating. Now as you can see, the uh, computation is complete and we get a hash value ending with 5a, 5e for the file, which should match back uh, the value published on the website. There you go. So if you compare the calculated value with the value published on the website, it should be exactly the same and uh, this proves that the um, file there's nothing wrong with the file download uh, the file that you download is exactly uh, the same as the copy that you uh, is published on the website now at this point I would also like you to read through the uh, software license published on the website okay this will show you um, the license for the using this uh, uh, this uh, virtual machine so have a read through the uh, terms and condition and uh, uh, before proceeding to use the uh, uh, the virtual machine that uh, you have downloaded from the website. 